What is up you guys, Matt here, Mr. Matt Darnell, and here in this video I'm going to show you guys how you can install Freestyle Dash 3 on your Reset Glitch Hack or JTAG Xbox 360. This is a really simple tutorial, you will need XCX Menu installed, you won't need Dash Launch however, uh, yet, although I will have links in the description below on how you can install Dash Launch in XCX Menu, as well as future tutorials for Freestyle Dash 3 also. I'm going to show you guys how you can install the newest revision, the newest version, and it will, I guarantee you it will be the newest version for a while to come. So let's go ahead and let's get started. So the first thing you're going to need to do is you will need to download uh, the Freestyle Dash 3. You'll get a 7-zip folder like here. As you can see, go ahead and open it up here. I'm going to be opening this in 7-zip. You can open this in RenRAR, WinZip, does not really matter. And as you notice, we can open this here, and we have uh, these five files. Go ahead and double click on this one. We want to extract this one. Once we have this extracted, we can go ahead and close this. And we have our F3 revision 775. Go ahead and open that one. And we just want to extract this. As you can see, we'll get a folder here named F3 Revision 775. Once we have this folder here, just go ahead and go to your flash drive. Make sure your flash drive is plugged into your PC and make sure it's formatted to FAT32. Go ahead and open your flash drive and we want to drag this folder right into our flash drive. It's going to copy this here and once it's copied we can go ahead and unplug our USB flash drive plug it into the Xbox 360 and I will see you guys on the Xbox 360. Alrighty guys now that we are on our Xbox 360 here we want to go ahead and plug in our flash drive go ahead and open up XEX menu as you can see, we have XCX menu opened up here, and we're going to go over to our applications discovery, and go ahead and press the right bumper, or you can press X, and go to your USB 1. As you can see here, we're just going to go press Y, uh, highlight the F3 revision 775 folder, press Y, copy it, press X, and you want to go to your hard drive, it would be HDD1, go ahead and press Y again and paste it. I already have uh, Freestyle Dash 3 installed on this console but you just go ahead and paste it. Once you paste it and it's copied onto your hard drive go ahead and open it up and you want to open up default.xex and it will load up Freestyle Dash 3 for us. Notice that mine looks a little bit different because I have already customized mine with a theme. But here is Freestyle Dash 3 for you guys. I will have a video in the future showing you guys how you can install games, homebrew, and all that good stuff on Freestyle Dash 3, as well as theme it to your heart's content. As you can see, it has removed all of the Xbox Live junk that you won't be able to uh, use unless you have a stealth service. And it has the link on here as well, which I'll have a video showing you guys how you can set up that as well also. This is how you install Freestyle Dash 3. To launch it, you just need to go to XCX menu, go over to your hard drive, and open that default.xcx file. And once we have it copied to the hard drive, we can remove it from our USB flash drive. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Hope this worked successfully for you guys. If it did not, leave a comment in the description below, and I will try my best to read them and respond to you guys. If not, go ahead and shout me an email. It's listed on my website, mrmattdarnell.com. Thanks for watching, guys. Until next time, guys, I will see you later.